Hi guys, I'm Amy Cassander for Red Carpet Report and we are at the Beverly Hilton to celebrate the 2017 American Ballet Theater Holiday Benefit. Alright, so season 14 of So You Think You Can Dance has wrapped and they're just, they just finished their tour. What did you think about Lex winning? What was that whole experience like? Well, you know, I don't think that we've seen a better dancer than Lex Ishimoto uh, on the entire series. Uh, he was outstanding right the way from the beginning. Um, he was a runaway winner. Uh, and the standard, I thought, in everything last season was just amazing. And I think, you know, taking it a, a, a one step on from the kids that we had the season before, it was really thrilling to bring back the adults for me so that we could get uh, a little more depth in our emotions. And now, season 15, what can we expect? Um, we can expect a recommission, hopefully, at some point from Fox. We haven't got it yet. Ah, come on, Fox! Come on, Fox! Come on. Yeah, we, uh, we had so much fun watching everyone, and the talent was immense. So now, here tonight, what, what do you think the Nutcracker means to everyone watching? Uh, I think the Nutcracker brings so many kids into the world of ballet. It starts at a very young age. They feel comfortable in coming to see a ballet. Uh, and, and I think that's thrilling. Any way that you can get kids out from in front of the televisions now and their video games is wonderful, you know? What was your first experience like while watching the first Nutcracker ever? What was that? Like? Uh, my, my first thing, I was a little frightened when I first saw it. You know, Drosselmeyer worried me. You know, it was, uh, it was, he was a bit scary in the figure. Yeah. Well, I, I hope it doesn't scare you now. He doesn't scare me now. No, a lot of other people do, but not Russell Meyer. Thank you so much for talking to us. I'm so excited about next year. Thank you Thank so you. much. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And let us know in the comments down below what your first experience is like while watching The Nutcracker.